In this video, we will study the morphology in cases of hereditary nephritis. Now, hereditary nephritis is an inherited disease in which there is mutations in the structure of proteins that form the glomerular basement membrane. So, this alteration in the structure of glomerular basement membrane results in thin glomerular basement membrane that is not functionally fit. Now, in the category of hereditary nephritis, there are two similar diseases that are Alport syndrome and thin basement membrane disease. Let's discuss the morphology in these two diseases. Now, usually in case of any glomerulopathy, we discuss the morphological features under the heading of light microscope, electron microscope, and immunofluorescence. But in case of hereditary nephritis, light microscopic changes are usually not apparent or prominent. But in late course of disease, you may see features of chronic kidney disease that are glomerular sclerosis, which is the narrowing of glomeruli, tubular atrophy, and interstitial fibrosis. Now we will mainly study its electron microscopic features. So firstly, let's study Alport syndrome. In Alport syndrome, the early cases will show thin glomerular basement membrane. But in late cases of Alport syndrome, along with thinning of glomerular basement membrane, there will be some foci of irregular thickening. Now these alternate areas of thickening and thinning appear like laminations or layers in the glomerular basement membrane. This appearance of laminations in glomerular basement membrane is known as basket weave appearance. It is called basket weave because it appears like the layers of a woven basket. So on electron microscopy of Alport syndrome, initially you see that glomerular basement membrane is thin and later, lately you see that there are laminations in glomerular basement membrane that is known as basket weave appearance. Now in second category that is thin basement membrane disease, the pathology is that there is diffuse and uniform thinning of glomerular basement membrane in all cases. That's why it is known as thin basement membrane disease. And in this disease, unlike the Alport syndrome, there will be no laminations or basket weave abeyance of glomerular basement membrane. So this concludes the morphological changes of hereditary nephritis.